I am Rafael Carbonaro. I'm the Vice President of Research and Development for Boston Scientific Neuromodulation. And I've been uh, with what is today, Boston Scientific Neuromodulation, for over 24 years uh, and working on research for uh, neuromodulation for you know, over 29 years now. It's a, it, it has been a childhood dream for me, so I'm very glad to be pursuing my, my dream job. For people who suffer some of these neurological uh, conditions, in particular movement disorders, like uh, Parkinson's disease and essential tremor, and there are millions of people in the US and the world that suffer these conditions, uh, what tends to happen is that the, the, some parts of the brain are having a certain, let's say, misbehaviors. They're sending the wrong signals that cause some of these symptoms that you can see uh, with, these type, uh, with these patients, with these people, uh, like, for example, tremors or, or rigidity and, and bradykinesia and so forth. And uh, so fortunately for us, uh, our brains are these electrochemical machines. And because they are this type of electrochemical machines, then we have the opportunity to place uh, some thin wires in specific areas of the brain so that we can correct these signals that are occurring that are causing uh, these symptoms. And with that, then we can provide uh, improvements in the life, in the quality of life of patients that suffer uh, from these, these conditions. Now, these wires are then connected to a, to a little device that generates these pulses of electricity. It's kind of like a, like, like a pacemaker and uh, that then help us provide this type of uh, therapy for, for people living with Parkinson's disease and essential tremor. Well, the part that I didn't mention before, by the way, is that there is a trick to make these therapies work really well. And that is the difference between, you know, good and great results. And, uh, and the difference is that uh, to, to get these great results, those targets on the brain are really very small. So they are tiny little targets on the brain. So, uh, so the actual placement of the little of the wires on the brain is, is, is a very quick procedure. It's essentially, you just uh, push the wires in place, but the physician actually sp spend a lot of time planning so that they can get the wire in the right place. Uh, and then once this uh, wire is in the right place, then it comes the process of trying to even fine tune even more so that uh, when we stimulate, uh, we try to reach those areas uh, that gives you the, the, the good effects and try to avoid stimulation of those areas that can give you side effects. And, uh, and that's when the, the whole system comes together. So a Versace Neural Navigator 5 software uh, uh, we comes with a SteamView XT feature. It's a new feature that we call image-guided programming. What it does, it allows us to uh, help these uh, movement disorder specialists that is programming the device to very precisely fine-tune stimulation uh, to, the, to the right place. But it does it in such a way that it's much simpler for the, for the movement disorder specialists to do this. So uh, when we first launched this uh, system, uh, that has this image guided programming, for example, uh, out of the gate, as a first, one of the first experiences, uh, we have a center that essentially they reduce their programming time by over 56%. Now, in average, programming takes about you know, 20 minutes. Uh, this is something that used to take hours before. Uh, so, uh, so, and what can you do with this time? You know, uh, these centers can now be able to see more patients and, uh, and, and as a patient, you have an opportunity to have a more meaningful interaction as well uh, with your physician during these sessions uh, because you have the time, uh, the time to do that. So it, it brings together, uh, this new release, it brings together the capabilities of a much simpler programming software, while at the same time give uh, the opportunity to bring all the power uh, that we have created in, this, in our implantable system, the Versailles uh, genome system to be able to deliver stimulation that is uh, designed to be very precise in the targeting of these uh, tiny little places in the brain. You know, from the very, very beginning uh, that uh, since been working with the embryo stimulation and 
and I mean, I'm going back now over 20 years of, of work. We, we knew that it was going to be extremely important to deliver very precise targeting. As I mentioned before, you know, your brain is a very uh, busy structure, right? So, uh, so uh, what that means is that uh, the areas that give you the effects and the areas that give you the side effects can be close to each other. So sometimes these type of millimeter variations are that difference between, you know, good effects and, and, and great, great effects on these patients. So we did two things. We design our, our implantable system, the, the, the little wire that you put in the brain and the, and the pulse generator that, that, that powers these uh, wires to be able to deliver with great control and finesse stimulation so that you are going to be able to fine tune and shape the stimulation field to try to adapt to each individual patient. Now with that comes a lot of flexibility in, in terms of what the programming system, the, the, the device can do. And, and it could be very, you would imagine that with so much flexibility, then you may take a lot of time, it can be difficult to program. And that's what we also have to develop this particular software that uh, we developed with uh, BrainLab, uh, which is a, is a company uh, in Germany. They are world experts in, uh, in, uh, in your surgery tools, particularly software to help this type of activities and uh, to create this very unique software that that brings all this power of the flexibility of the stimulator in a manner that is much simpler so for physicians to use and then help their patients to get, uh, to get better outcomes. So that's the design intent of our system. And you know, uh, the, I think the results are speaking for themselves. I mean, uh, uh, it's been adopted. Now the majority of the programming that is done is done with this type of tools. We call it much guided programming as part of Steam UXT. And um, it's probably one of the fastest adoption I've seen of uh, this type of innovation uh, in the field. So, so definitely very exciting, very rewarding to see this. Thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to, to talk to you and being able to reach other, other people uh, through, through your channel here. Because um, this therapy, I mean, if you, if, you see, if you see the impact that this therapy can have, um, in people living with Parkinson's and essential tremor, you can only, you know, you can go to our website or you can go to, uh, to other sites and you can see the video uh, of these patients. With the turn of a switch, uh, the, the impact in patients' lives is just, um, is just evident. And, uh, and we're able to help thousands of people every single year. Uh, but there is a lot of people that still uh, do not uh, have not been offered this type of therapy, or they 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 are unaware of this therapy exists. So uh, so the, what you're offering me is the opportunity to to reach out to others and patients or their or their caregivers and relatives to 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 go and ask their physician to see if this therapy can help uh, transform their lives uh, their lives as well. So consider that as an option. Because, you know, that's our mission, to transform uh, the lives of people around the world through these innovative medical solutions. And, uh, 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 and I hope to be able to do that uh, uh, with, more, with more people around the world.